I just fucking realized that was going. What <sighs> I wish I could see. It would be so nice to be able to see, like at all. That'd be great. It's holy fuck. Sun's bright. What's going on? <clears throat> Little fucky. <sighs> it's like really fucking bad today. Did your settings reset when you did your stuff? <sighs> Don't know, but I'm about to <clears throat> fuck with it. Who needs frames anyway? It's infuriating. Let's see how much I can fucking see how many tears I can get in my screen before it comes back. Oh, there we go. I think I'm good for now. He fixed me. <clears throat> I can fix her. We both know that's a fucking <laughs> See you later, bye. Are oh, you off already? Okay. Do you not have work to do? <laughs> yeah, I suppose. I pay my rent and eat and I know, I'm just secure delaying stuff. You don't want to go sit in the blacksmith just like your old dad then. For like hours on hours and hours. <clears throat> Been busting my ass the last couple of days, so I'm just. Ugh. Oh, if you ever want to run away, I could teach you how to throw that knife of yours. <sighs> I know you wanted me to do that back <clears throat> then, but now that I actually have time. I've actually been doing a bit of training with that. Not half bad. We'll see about that. <laughs> I challenge you to a throw-off. <clears throat> Do you have throwing knives? Mm, I've got rocks. I have a throwing knife and it's not on me. We'll get you more. We just <clears throat> gotta find iron. <clears throat> yeah. But first, coin, which yeah. I'm about to go make for the both of us. Also... If Mirandel asks you anything about Gradian Spice involving me or anything having to do with any money, you didn't hear anything. I haven't spoken to you about it at all. Understood? Okay. He was down there last night when you brought it up with us, though. Ah, oh, you're right. I'm about to royally fuck him over. <clears throat> Hopefully. I did not hear you say that, then. How about that? <laughs> He's been fucking us on iron prices, so I'm not. We'll see too... if it works. Have to try first. That's why he needs a taste of his own medicine <clears throat> from his own kind. 
He wants to play drow. I'm going to show him how to play drow. Don't fuck over your own friends. Good luck. Don't need luck. I'm a fucking professional. Is it this door? No. Nope. <clears throat> ah, here they are. Well, it's not my fault you live in a fucking labyrinth. Good luck today. You too. I'll come visit. <clears throat> Remember, chat, we don't fuck our friends over. That's the true meaning of being a drow. Chat, 20 divided by 4. Is that 6? Five? <clears throat> I knew I was close. Alright. Right, it's 6 with this extra one.
We episode six or seven? Give me a coin. Oh, don't do that. I. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> it's good to see you. Good morning. Hi. It's good to see you as well. <laughs> How are you? <clears throat> Doing well. I got back a bit later. There was a little bit of a pulling a bit, a bit of a from your your deck last night. <laughs> Well, I hope you didn't take too much. No, nothing too much. Good morning, Master. Welcome back. Good, now that you're here, how are you? Uh, I'm alright, but... Uh, sadly, I don't bring, bring present... Let me try that again. I don't bring pleasant news. I think the cart might have addled my brain a little bit. Apologies. That's I'm okay. Still trying to catch you. <clears throat> it's fine. We all we all get that after long extended travel. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> yeah. well, I have some news that you'll like to hear, but uh, you yourself may want to hear it as well, but. Should we wait for Tazim, mm -hmm. or...? Can do, if you wish. I don't want to take away from your working hours, but, uh... As a note for you, lass. Stories from home. Really? Oh? Uh -huh. Um, why don't you come in? Yes, yeah, sadly, none of it good. Aye. Uh, yes, please come in. Uh, take a seat. I'll take a seat <clears throat> in something a little bit more comfortable than wood, if you wouldn't mind. Oh, please do. <sighs> so, what's... The word. I went to meet my kin at the embassy. The one we passed. Right. Yes. There has been no news from my hold. None. None. What's worse None? is that none. And what's worse? We've lost contact with every hold from well, east, no, west of Ireland. All the western holds? <clears throat> every hold from the closest to the Eshmathalas borders upwards, we've lost all communication. I fear that it may have something to do with the... yes. I fear it may have... Overspell. From Ireland. Those rat Seems things. the rats are not just interested in your home. Instead they've moved into the mountains. <sighs> That's not good. Well, and with most of the longbeards away... They've not met much resistance. Still to hear nothing from any of them, that must have been so quick. Indeed. Not to mention, you always, you had your hands filled dealing with an awk incursion as well. Now the rats? There's a lot going on in the deep. Not all of it I'm aware of, but <clears throat> what I could pry from them. The holds are quiet. We have received no warrants many of the holds in our area. We may be seeing a few of acquaintances in the area. 
ones I'm afraid I don't think any one of us want to be seeing again. Acquaintances. You won't be me- you won't be meaning- The same folks that overran your island now overrun the mountains. It's only a matter of time before they spill back out again. The fucking imps. Oh, rats. Fuck, okay. That had me worried. <clears throat> well, you should still be concerned. Oh, of course, but yeah. What about Adwick? Tell me last. Anything about Adwick? That's what I'm about to say. From the scouts that we got from Von Voldor, the news has been that elves from Ishmathalas have made their way into Ireland, and in vast number. Armed elves. I haven't heard um. anything much after that, that's all that we... All we got was that the elves moved large numbers and very quick. And they invaded into Ireland not too long ago. Whether or not to help or not, I do not know. There have been uh, whispers of a uh, dignitary from the elves actually meeting with the Radards here as well. That does not bode well, considering what you just told us. Helgi are making moves. And we are in no position to interfere. Is how did this is to say? God, I say I have to find the timing a little opportune at this point. They probably knew it was was. We spent we sent missive after missive to for aid from Eshmith Ross. And they answer back with no concern whatsoever and now they come all the rats would threaten their border as much as your own but so do the imperials it may even be the reason and why and indeed to cross our landy soil imperials are no longer the threat in Ireland no nothing can get through that fog apart from the rats any that enter the fog Become deathly ill and die soon after, if what the scouts have sure. said are to be believed. And it covers a vast array of land over Ireland. So the fog's the still out. They're going to get to you. The only way they're going to get to your homeland now is if they divert through the north, or manage to somehow get from here through the mountains. Neither of which are going to be an easy trick. So you're saying my homeland is caught in between the rats and the elves, and both Adwick and the, the Western Houses are completely stranded. I do not know what the Elgi propose to do. I only know that they moved in large number and into your lands. They may even be the reason why the rat overflow spilled into the mountains. They're pushing them out. This <laughs> is important that we get it's to not Arn. impossible. <clears throat> this, uh, yeah. I certainly hope it's to push the rats out and know they'll turn in motives. I sincerely hope. The problem no, that we have there has to be ulterior motives, the... otherwise they would have done it when we were at war with the Empire. Because we know, we are both... We all know how Ashmith laws was. As long as it doesn't cross their borders, they do not care. They've never cared about human or Dawei politics until now, and all of a sudden, there's this mass push into Araland out of nowhere. No, something else is at play here. I might want to speak to that uh, elven merchant. Perhaps he can shed some light. Veseran, I believe. Mm -hmm. I want to bring this up with Arn before we make any extra moves. I... I... Yeah. 
I do apologize that I don't have any better news, but I myself am still reeling from the fact I still have no port. Yeah. And with most of the holes in our nearest vicinity gone, I'm concerned that we may have a bit of a rat problem of our own soon. Especially if they've made it into the deep roads. That would be the way that you would get messages through, right? Your scouts and such. That would explain why you haven't heard anything. And that basically leads them, well, directly to Vernfoldur and then... Well... I don't know that. Once Vernfoldur, Vernfoldur closed its gates, the mountain passes were no longer being regulated meaning they could get free and easy passage over the mountains. Perhaps they may be engaging the orcs that are attempting to get into Ireland, which is why we've not heard much from the surface. But from below, they may have even freer reign than we do. That is worrying. That's extremely concerning. There is talk of the dwarves sending an expedition to find out just how bad things are. I tell you this now because I trust both you and your forge master. But I myself am concerned. For if they find that the holes that we have lost contact with did not fall to the rats. It's not impossible for it to be the rats. We believe it to be the overflow. But what we saw beneath that keep. Right. I can only surmise that's about a trick of what their true forces were. If they are if they're strong enough to take down the Imperial Legion in a matter of minutes. And it was only due to the fact that they were fighting those mushrooms that would keep them so occupied. I'm terrified to see them, their full strength. I'm only grasping at the straws that I have been given, but I... I have a nasty feeling. If it's not the rats, it could be them. The mushrooms. Yes, those. Not a day goes by, I forget that voice clan. All I know... All we know is that we believe it to be the Overflow. Well, you mentioned that they they take over bodies and absorb the knowledge, right? Right. Why, they're fighting the rats down there. It's only a matter of time before they gain the rats' knowledge and they I've start applying that. Not seen a mushroomified rat yet, and they were fighting for a long time. But they were also fighting a lot of the Imperials. I've... There's a lot of moving parts here. Mushrooms, rats, elves. Fuck. There is a lot going on, and I'm afraid I have no answers to most. But you should take some solace in the fact that the elves are deemed to move. At the very least, I feel that... You have not to fear from the rats, not much anymore. If the elves are intervening, they may still be friendly to your people. And that's a big... Uh, I have some. Uh, I wouldn't I have count no, on it, but it'd be nice. I have no kind feelings towards the Elge. Right. That's no secret, you, both your kingdoms and their Garlan to begin with. <sighs> and most of them have been at war. If you forgot, we had a bit of a skirmish on the border between one of the whole of the nation of Alas. I heard about that. There was a dispute of the territories when, uh, from what I heard, as we at least through the grapevine. Last I remember, there was war, but I was disconnected from that due to my expedition. 
I do not know what the state is in comparison to that. But that is the information that I have received. That's... Thank you for bringing this to us, and... I appreciate you. It's just no... It's no problem, but... Like I said, I trust you and your family. We'll find Arn, bring it up with him, see what he makes of it. I need to talk to him anyway, so... That's the main thing I'm working on right now. My kinsman apparently has something to speak with me about. Okay. <sighs> I'm glad you got back safe. The Forge Master Noy has my regards. Of course. If you require me, I'll more than likely be at my study. Understood. I can there then. I didn't think that fuck that would still be up. But that would have dissipated by now. It's been two years since we triggered it. It was given to us as a last chance kind of option. I just didn't think it would... I suppose it's kind of good. There's no Imperials getting through. You're not at fault here. You didn't know what you were doing. We did what we could. If there's anyone that has to hold the butter of that, it's me and... the Adwick military. No. We knew exactly what we were using when we that. We knew it would be catastrophic. We knew it would cause devastation on an untold... an untold factor. It had to be done. And we still did it. It had to be done. Apologies, right. God are asking for you, or uh, the Forge Master. Oh, fuck. Okay. My guy that's gonna kill me family. I'm so angry. There we go. Oh, my is gonna my head. Kill me. Yeah, oh. I feel the same way. How can I help you? I just had a report that someone was snooping outside of your business, so I need to... My guards didn't see him until the last moment, so if you find anything missing... What do they look like? I was told he's about the same height as me, has a long brown ponytail, a brewmaster. Right, okay. If I uh, see him, I'll ask him a couple questions then. I'm sure he doesn't mean any harm. I, hope I don't think he would. Uh, I am trying to repair a sword for him. Made. He may be uh, looking for it. That might be it. Then that would explain why he, he was just apparently standing right there from what they saw, but... Sure. But I'd... Well, thank you. Yeah. That's more likely the case. If you find Tizim, let him know that we need to have a talk, because that's worrying news. Agreed. What are your plans for today? No wonder I haven't been able to send any letter. None at the moment. Yeah. I just hope we can at least find, a, find an answer to all these questions we have and problems instead of more questions. We only get questions. I, there's so much moving. Can't focus on that for now. Oh. For now, yeah. Getting by. God. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Could definitely be worse. Indeed. <sighs> right. Work. 
appreciate it. Indeed, Raven. <sighs> My mind's gonna be on this all day. Which one's that for? This one's for the farmer, Harry. He wanted his sword repaired. It should be done whenever he shows up, I guess. What do you think? Possible? Hmm. Where am I? There we go. Hi! Sorry, I was just checking my brain real quick. Um, Wait a minute. Shariq, are you good at sharpening stuff as well as making things? I'm actually the best. Oh, wonderful. Uh, how much is it to sharpen? Um, um, oh, hold on. This. Uh, for something like that, about 20 copper. I could get it done. Oh, 20 copper to just sharpen? Well, uh, we usually charge 15 for a short dagger or something like that, but I don't know. You've been nice about the uh, straps. Maybe I could drop it down to 15 for you. Sure. By the way, did you tell someone that I gave you a discount? No. Because boss man heard and I got yelled at a I lot. Tell anyone. That's really strange. Uh, okay. Well, we Maybe haven't even, hang on, we haven't even bought something. anything from you yet. I know, that's why I was, like, wondering who, like, openly, I did. it's fine, it's fine, and they, uh, it's all good, it's clear now, I just had to do a lot of chores, but yeah, if you could sharpen this, that would be really great. Sure, come um, back in, like, yeah, 15 20. minutes, make it 10. Alright, here we go. 10 copper. All Sorry right. for the trouble. <laughs> Thank you. No, it's all right. Thank you. I yeah. appreciate that. Come back in like 20 minutes. All right. I'll come back. Hi. <sighs> I was told someone was sneaking around my forge well, this morning. Terrible. I was looking for somebody to ask if I could borrow the grind. Do what now? I needed to sharpen a blade to go and cut some uh, flowers for some soap. I needed to borrow the grind wheel so m make sure it wasn't dull. I can sharpen it for you. I'll... It's already taken care of and done. Don't worry. Got it. No, no. I just was going to. I was just, just looking for somebody to ask. See if I could, I could use the grind wheel, but nobody was here, so I think some miscommunication got crossed. I've started work on your sword, by the way. If you come by late tonight or early tomorrow morning, it should be done. Alright. See whether or not my sleep schedule keeps me in that line. Yeah. Just letting you know it's been worked on. Alright. I'll chat with you later. I gotta go sure. make sure this soap is ready. <sighs> Miss Ladia. Yes, Mr. Yes, Mr. Shriek. Um, I'm wondering if you will be wanting any food today. I'm making some base meals today. Um, so I thought I'd ask. Maybe, um, if you like shrimp and tartar sauce. I'm doing two meals for 35. You hear his stomach rumble loudly. <laughs> yeah, that actually sounds really good. Is that so, a yes? Yes, that is a, a resounding yes. Hey. Two meals for 35, you said? Anyone else? If you outsource a bit more, I'd do it for 65 for four. Uh, cover our meals and I can give you the 35. How about that? Sounds good. I'll get it ready. I'll It'll uh, take... pay you in advance. Oh, no. I'll do it when I deliver it. It's fine. You no. sure? Just in case we're not here, then you can leave fine. it. Yes. 
I'll be back. Okay. It doesn't take long to make. It'll be about ten minutes. Okay. I can help. Leather strap work good. We haven't used it yet, but it, yeah, we have it, so that's handy. We're not getting charged All fucking right. eighty copper for it, so yeah, I appreciate it. Yes, I hope not. When I heard that from the other smithy, I was, I was, mm -mm, mm, just no, just yeah. no. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. No, no, you're good though. Mm -hmm. no, you're good. Mm -hmm. Hey, Bargo. I had an option. You've been eye fucking that blade for a while. What's up? Uh, Masco Rasco, I believe it was. He said he could hire me on. I know this blade. What? Something like that, ten copper. It seems like an interesting job, but. What do you there's mean? No way I'd them. There's no way I'd be able to miss it. Uh, Let's take this for anything else. Hmm. Really? What is it? This is our funny <laughs> plate. I'd say keep your I options mean. open. That right. Maybe, maybe I upset him because, uh, when Not just anything else. The man this bot blade belong to. Hope it didn't upset him. Diane Adwick. Hmm. I think it was more so that he wanted to use you to do your job right now. <laughs> Want me to ask him about it when he comes back for it? Well, that, wouldn't that be short -sighted? I think it's best yeah. for you to <sighs> things before you do them. There's some exactly. oddities of business that go along around here. Try not to get too direct, but well, there's absolutely no way that this blade would have been in. If this is who belongs who I think it did belongs, there's no way it, it should belong. It should end up here. Who's it supposed to belong to? Come inside real quick. I don't want to make this too public. I forgot and I started it. You're a piece of shit, you know that? I forgot. I have a... It's not my fault you forgot. It's not my fault you forgot. You're actually gonna make I mean, you haven't product. done the work. So, when you've done the work, I can pay I, you. Okay, listen, listen. Greg, I paid you half Sharif, yesterday okay, for doing the half the work. the work. Yes, and I paid you half of it. And I'm supposed. Now, I, I, you know, I'm a very busy woman and I haven't got all day. All right. So, I scheduled time with you today. So if you want to crawl into calendar, that fire, by all means. I don't want to crawl in there. I just feel like you should compensate me a little bit for your blunder, is all I'm saying. That's friends. Unless you don't want my little brothers to eat. Hello, ma'am. I'm just saying, can you believe this guy? Forgot about me. Now I'm out of a paying job today and my little brothers don't get to eat. I mean, they could probably lose the weight, I'm gonna be fair. Share the a couple apple little assholes, but they still gotta eat. This? Now this is mine, okay? Mm. I gotta go home to a loud-ass fucking house. I got an apple every day. And an apple ain't gonna feed two growing boys. I want them to be bigger than whatever's going on here. I can pay you in advance when you do take care of it. How about that? Then they can eat today. Oh, you know you're driving a hot bargain, Shariki. You really, really twisted. If you don't want, if you don't want your brothers to, to eat today, that's no, fine I'm, by me. I can just go I'm inside just saying, and do I'm my thing. I'm just saying. I'm, I'm not saying I'm upset. I said you're twisting my arm a little. It's a little bit unfortunate, but we gotta work with what we got. And this we is do. start of a beautiful friendship, so you know it's give and take. So I'm gonna take what you give today. So. You can take that 10 copper, and you can give Thank your you. brothers a meal. And then tomorrow morning... Well, that's exactly what I'm gonna do. I Are you gonna turn it on it. tomorrow? Hey, yo, uh, what's your name? Tall and poofy. Isabella. All right, Bella, you see this fucking knucklehead turning on the forge tomorrow, you smack him upside the head. <laughs> I'll keep watching him then. <laughs> Okay, well that was took a long time. Are you sure she's all there? It took her a long time to respond to me. She's EP. Yes, sir. Ah, okay. Well, <laughs> you know what? Not my business. I came to do my job. You fucked that up. I'm gonna hold a mental grudge against you about this for a while. Just Understood. Keep that in mind. Okay. Uh -huh. Do you need something, Sif? Marv, do you need anything today? Would... How much for eight pieces? 
Unfortunately, I cannot spare eight pieces today. The best I can do is four. Four is, yeah, four will work. Four? Um... Since I know the Forge Master had a broken arm earlier, and he's been kind to me, we'll call it fifteen. Sure. I'll pay you in advance. If I'm not here, just uh, drop them off, okay? Yep, I know where to put it. Thank you, Sif. Of course. Also, if you wish to tell the Forge Master that I'm looking to gather people together that have at least been kind to me or I'm sort of close to in town to have some sort of... I wouldn't say feast, because I'm not exactly a Jarl, but kind of a get-together with food involved. That yeah. you are all invited. Sure, when and where? Uh, probably be the logging camp a couple days. I still need to get all the food together. Yeah, I'll uh, let him know. Thank you. Mm. Thank you. <sighs> of course. Okay. Inside. The soul that belonged to was one of one of Dara's men that were executed. His name was Nathaniel. How do you know that? You could say that he and his family have a bit of a history with mine. And you are... Nothing bad. A hundred percent sure. There's no way I would mistake this blade. What was his that last then name? you would always, um... Librius. Uh, yes. I second to that. Hmm. I... I don't know how it ended up here. There's no way that... There's no way that... This third would end up last. You think his family would have passed it down, maybe? I suppose. The question that I have I... now is, who is this Harry person? I don't know. I... I could definitely say that if anyone would try to try the sword, it'd be just as bad as trying to pry it from my blade from, my, from me. That is... It's a treasured item, something that they... Hmm. Okay. I'll press him on it when he comes in. I won't dig too deep, obviously. I don't want to tilt our hand, but I trust your judgment on it. I'll see what he says, see what I can glean from him. I would like to know at least... How he got it. I hope it was not pronto stolen. Nathaniel was. He wasn't a cruel man. It's on the wrong side. We had it. My, fa my family is a. Like so many people in that un abhorrent little schism of theirs. I saw many good people die needlessly that didn't deserve it. So you're saying no, because of the words of one man. No way they would have sold the sword or anything like that. Okay. There's no way in, on on this on this. There's no possible way that that would ever happen. 
Anyone who will, any family member will rather sort of sooner die than give away. Right, so if he spins me some bullshit about f buying it somewhere, I'll know he's lying. I don't think so. Right. Okay. <sighs> Just bring back some hopeful memories from an incident. So many good men and women that didn't need to print. You did what you could. At the very least. I want to honor Nathaniel's memory at the very least to figure out why he is here. I can do that. Thank you, Carla. Anything for you. I know it's none of you. It means a lot. For now, I just... Finish up and see what we can learn at least. Sure. I'll figure it out, okay? Alright. Would you call me? <clears throat> the devil. I need to talk to you about, um... Just fucking walk into that. Prices for, um, or the, um... <laughs> I need to roll. No, I'm just kidding. Um, I, I need to talk to you about the money owed for the shipment yesterday. I still need two silver from you all, and I need to know if you want another shipment today. How much would you sell a chicken for? Didn't we pay you? Assuming you were in a no, not yet. Yeah. Okay. Unless you left it on the counter somewhere. Yeah, yeah, saw this. <laughs> no, I can pay you. <laughs> Let me grab it from the coffers. Come on, Marco. It's more than fun. You should be Two silver, you said? And that should be for the ten over the, the ten yes. you got for in exchange for the sword. Yes. Right. Good deal. All right, so. With that, are you going to want more at the same price, or uh, like do you, you want me to hold off for now? Hold off for now. For Corsetto right now. Tazim's not very happy with the prices, so I'd hold off. Right. <laughs> and it makes two of us. If I'd lower the price anymore, I would. You know, we're going to have to upcharge everyone for every order that they take in, and when they ask us why it's so expensive, we're going to have to say veterans charging us a fucking arm and a leg for it. I'm not charging you an arm and a leg for it. I'm charging you a very reasonable price considering I'm only making Marco. enough to cover my expenses on it. Is your business Are you okay? Yes. Yeah, we'll see what happens when these mines open up again. Listen. Are you okay? Looks like you're... When the mines open up again, I will happily bring you cheaper iron. But for now, I've got one source, and they are exorbitantly expensive. Have you seen Morden's back today? Ah, he is. Good. Yeah. I'll have to talk to him. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Ugh, man. So much going on. Alright, well... So it's a no? I want to make... No for today, no more iron. Alright, here you go. No iron. It's a bit, uh... Well... To say the least. I'll leave you to your business. Please know that I'm not trying to fleece you. I, as you can see, I guess I have a job. I to make it to Cassetta. You lead the way, huh? They're having me deliver I guess so. Okay. 
We're all just trying to get by. I get it. It's just frustrating. Every time we make a little bit of silver off an order, it goes directly into getting more iron. You can guess the frustration. Thank you, Isabella. I know. If you need it upcharge, there's no issue with that. Just let them know the truth. There is not enough iron in the city. Sure. Uh, good morning, Harry. I'll uh, tell them it's your fault my and where you live sure and you... when you fall asleep oh, and how right. to open okay. the back window. Okay. <laughs> um, I'm, he was working on the blade from what I could tell. What? Uh, I, it might be <laughs> odd. Your threat sent me to another realm. Ugh. All right. Good, uh, I have to leave this yeah, place. Yeah, go for it. I have to go. Yes, it's done. I've got it right here. This is a safe place for me. I'll see you later. Perfect. I have to ask, I've never seen a blade like this. Do you mind if I ask where you got it from? Uh, it was a gift. Oh, really? Hi. Well, who's handing out good swords like that? Well, I need to get in contact with them. Get one of my own. Well, I'll be quite honest. I'm not quite sure where they got it from, but uh, it looks finely made. Thank you very much. Of course. Anything to help out the local farmers. Right. Well, have a good rest of your day. And you too. think something's off yeah doesn't feel right I'm not one to let my pressure Treasured items of men that I respected fell in the hands of just anyone. Well, he didn't say that he bought it, so... And if it was a gift, then... Hmm. Maybe... Still... Still begs the question about what, who, exactly who it is. Yeah. So the one that Mark was giving me is him for well hello and every day. The one you yeah. oh. so you're the one that I dropped off everything for you. It's gonna be very helpful. Yes, but keep tabs until that at this point. Very good. Okay. Something to speak to you. About something not that Sorry, what? I guess we just have to pay attention at this point. We'll keep an eye and see what he does, if anything. As you look in that direction, Kyler, you see a little bit of powder from the alabaster kind of fall and hit the ground ever so slightly. As you come closer, it is a claw mark. One nail that has gone around the corner. What's the matter? She's here. Who's here? Risa. What? <laughs> she's 
she's been... <laughs> she's been fucking with all of us. Over the last while, I thought I heard her last night, I wasn't sure. Fuck. You're such a mess. Apparently, Sarah Ruth saw something basically exactly the same thing as we saw down in the catacombs. And Arn heard fucking footsteps around. And I've been feeling like I've been watched these last couple of days. And that just fucking confirms it. She's fucking tormenting us, and I don't know why. I swear I won't let a single- I won't let at least lay a single finger on you, so help me God. Whoa. <laughs> okay. We're going somewhere. He points to the pillar of the side there, <laughs> and you see one- As you look here, you see what looks like one nice long claw mark. Shh. And it wraps around the side. There's still po powder from the alabaster on the ground. To say. I don't know either. I just. So we weren't the only ones that went through there. Did you not see anyone running through? Who? Yeah, change the subject. Did you see anyone running in a hurry through here? Uh, no. I was head down looking at work. Why? Perception check, Kyler. Uh, maybe. Well, seven. You haven't interacted with this man entirely too much. But the few times you have, he seemed rather stoic, always about his business. At the moment, he looks almost wild-eyed. Not as if he's in a panic, but there's something that's confusing him. Uh, no, I was head down. Are you okay? Quite fine, but I couldn't help but notice that, uh, well, I was standing over there. I could have sworn someone had ran past behind me. I felt it. There's no one there. You didn't see anything, did you? Nothing at all. Can't hear anything. Have... Mm. Just peculiar. Usually, if you feel a breeze over there, it's at your face, not your neck. No. I won't bother you about it then. Keep on about your day. Who is that? Do you remember, do you remember your friend Aegon in the tavern? Oh shit. That could mean that she's fucking Back there. Him too. This isn't good. But can you climb? I... I don't know what to do about any of this. I... <sighs> he wasn't even down there with us. But she knows him. She does. It's all it takes. You've so, already spoke to that girl. What do we fucking do? Does that mean... There's nothing to do. Well, do we round Hide. up everyone and tell them? <sighs> I 
Where would we meet? That's <laughs> big enough. That I, doesn't look fucking I, suspicious. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't even know if we do. I just... Let's just play it safe for now. I'll bring it up next time I see Tazim. Lesser knows. Mar knows. You know. You know. I know. Raylan. She must still be at sea. Oh. <laughs> at least we might have some comfort that she might have be some safety over there. At least in... to our knowledge. Oh god, unless... Maybe. I doubt she can fucking swim. Keep an eye out for more scratches like that. I thought I heard something and then I... Mm. Fuck. Uh, yeah. I don't know what to do. Question is, is just talking to everyone who's down there? It wasn't even down there. It was just in the town. Has the Forge Master been by as of yet? No, not yet. I've been waiting for him, though. <sighs> well, this time's been a fucking play. We should change the subject for now. <sighs> right. Um, any caravans heading out today? I don't know. Merc building might have something later. Just waiting for the sun to come up. Yeah. I'll be back in a moment. Right. <clears throat> Hopefully the Forge Master will make an appearance at some point. And we can discuss further what we... Yeah. Yeah. Spoke of. I also need to get this information from Esserin from his trip to the Embassy. I'm a bit ill-informed as to what happened. Yeah, I told him you're around. He should be looking for you. I don't know that I'll be waiting in my study. Understood. I'm having some severe issues concentrating out here. It seems to be a few people having that issue. <clears throat> How are you doing, Kinsman? Some good coin coming in tonight. In regards to that thing you told so me about? Need anything. Yes, it's actually going quite well. Good. I'm very excited about doing business tonight. I make quite a lot of silver, actually. I just love how kind all the mercenaries are to each other. When one of them gets a job, they spread it around to the other. Mercenaries like little rats. And they're like, jeez, jeez. And they all go running back to the Merc building. <laughs> they gotta support each other, I suppose. <laughs> it's cute. I suppose, know? right? <clears throat> they could just take all the money for themselves and let everyone else starve, but they don't. It's like a little family. <laughs> I could almost care about them, minus him. <laughs> him? Him. He's annoying. Yeah. But he is a good fighter. Mm. That is for sure. <sighs> ow, ow. I wonder if Drudge is going to have a fight today. Well, don't. Do that. <sighs> that fucking hurt. I felt that across the fucking ocean. 
Oh. Indeed. <laughs> oh, you poor thing. Oh, it's okay. Need some Epsom salt. Cocoa butter. Oh, my fucking eyes are watering. <laughs> longer than I expected. That's okay. <sighs> Shrimp and tartar sauce. Thank you. I would say 35, was it? Mm -hmm. Shrimp. 35. Thank you, miss. Thank you. Good to see you. You enjoy? Mm -hmm. So shrimp. Ow! Match these small little uh, creatures <sighs> inside this dish. <laughs> oh my god, he's dead. Oh my god, my fucking eyes are watering. He's still me. living, at least. What the fuck is a shrimp? <clears throat> uh, these uh, small creatures in here, I imagine. Pulled them out. <laughs> no, they're actually tasty. <sighs> they have, like, shells around yeah. them. They're very small. And you can just eat handfuls of them. Yeah. Sarah, you see what... You see Kyler pull out what looks <laughs> like a little red <laughs> dog. Mm. Stop! That's fucking nasty! Take a bite! Eat it. I dare you. Eat it. No, you eat it first. Why are you doing that? Why are you fucking wiggling it around like that? You wanna- you wanna bite? <laughs> Here comes the boat. Here comes the trebuchet shot. Ah. <laughs> Not bad, in it. I like him. Mm. Really contemplating this one, Sarah. It's good. I like it. Very good. Very good. We should ask Ladia for more. I don't more. like that they come in shells, though. That's disgusting. Well, Ladia's de-shelled them, thankfully. Oh, oh, oh. Them. <laughs> Ow, at least most of them. Having your skin ripped off. <laughs> what's that red yeah, shit there's like, there's... in there? What do you mean red shit? Oh, no, the white. What's the white it's sauce? It's, uh... Tartar uh, sauce? Twatter. Right? I think that's what they... Something. Ta ta ta. I don't know what it is, but it tastes good, so. It smells like Darren. Oh, wow. Hello, beautiful people. Oh, this thing is moving. Uh. Not a fucking word. Georgie, do you want a shrimp? <laughs> Not a fucking word. Alright. <laughs> no, Drow, do not bark. That's a me thing. Oh. What is that fucking noise? Thank you. <laughs> mm. I don't think I'm supposed to be hearing uh, that. I'm not hearing anything. Oh. anything. I'm not hearing anything right now. That's good. You just I'm ate. Welcome. Okay, Chef. You want to see some Bjorning magic? Oh, I'm scared. Put the stool Please down. Don't hurt me. Uh. What's stool? Oh. 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 <laughs> oh. Suddenly stool. I've got to grab it by the scrot. <clears throat> the teat. That's good enough. I just didn't <laughs> fuck about fixing it. You have tongs in your hands still. <laughs> oh really? Oh no. That's unfortunate. Oh. <sighs> now I can pull your teeth out. Oh. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> What the? What the? Um, what did you have that hiding? Sheree, can I get my always, knife back, please? Can always I have, have some tongs up my sleeve. Can I have this? Um. Please don't break them. Thank you. <laughs> what do you think? Wow. Organs I can yeah. Good job. Yeah. I should be able to shave some leather with this. You... Oh. That's what you have your hands for. Those are for the harder to pull out things. But then I would fuck up my nails. If I... <laughs> Just lick them clean. 
No. Bad. Just wear gloves all the time. Don't. Don't do Stop. that. Then your I'm hands like never get clean. between the both of you. I can't. Oh my like, god, I you have fingerless gloves. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Well, it's better for Rolfs. To get those from Warm Topic. Which parts aren't. Did you like suck all the pigment <laughs> off your what? fingers? What do you mean? The clothing store. Who's your name? Uh, Miss... Oh, what was your... You're... Uh, 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 Maybe that was me. The soup store. Isabella. The soup no, store? Good morning, Miss Isabella. How are you? How are you supposed to be closing off as a soup store? Thank you so much. I really That's appreciate good, it. Of course. No. Uh, right. and I certainly hope you I'm going to soon. try to be creative. I have ideas oh, yeah. and plans and thoughts. Oh, so oh, I'm going to dangerous. try to do them. Uh, uh, I know, Ms. isn't that? Uh, when is they? I heard that. Kylie, you want to go to dinner it's tonight? Like <coughs> to to Shazim, Tazim, sh who? Seizure, whatever the fuck your name is. Sharik. <laughs> no, you had seizure. Yeah. yeah. Go to dinner tonight with <laughs> Tordy. <laughs> Uh, yeah, All we right, could. You know, cool. tonight then. Yeah, I've already eaten today, yeah. but sure, so I could gorge myself a little bit. No, we just eat cheese and bread. Don't worry about it. Oh, a shashushery. Dinner with Torty, whoever you are, and seizure. Yes, that's me. Yeah. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Once Watch uh, out, not into the time, forge. We'll meet at the tavern, but we'll go somewhere else because the topics we're going to speak about don't deserve to be spoken about in some fucking tavern. Do you want these? I'm seriously going to harm yeah. someone with them if you don't take them from me. I'll go. <laughs> uh, have a good day. See you all around. Bye, Dodgy. Bye, Restory. They're probably I'm supposed to be somewhere just else. Just fucking take them. Well, I'm trying to find a good way to grab them so you don't grab my finger off. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> okay, baby, that dangerous. <laughs> <sighs> God, it's like fighting a snake. The claw. <laughs> It really fucking hurts. I won't do it. <laughs> Rip his nose off. Rip his nose off. Got your nose! <laughs> I feel like Dredge would like that one. I'm gonna relay that one to him. Oh, please don't! He'll actually do it! No, and him, he'll probably do that in the rain. I'm gonna go find Dredge now. Fucking lead poisoning. Yep, same. I was actually gonna go find Drudge too. I wanna go watch him beat the shit out of people. Perfect, let's go find him together. Oh, uh, Disgusting. Even my- Come on, Shriek, even I went- Come on, you you know what that's been. Yeah, in the- f It burns off all the bad bits. And you want to sit in your food? Well, fine. Eat what you eat. What the fuck is that? <laughs> Crouch down again. <laughs> what the fuck is that? Cheeky freaky. <laughs> right, you little oh. fuck. <laughs> <laughs> I'm renaming the forge Guantanamo Bay. Oh no, don't do that. Don't do that. Bring me a bucket and a cloth. <laughs> I gotta get some answers out of this little fucker. Oh no, no. <laughs> Where's. No, never mind. We don't want to make an international. We don't want to take a national incident. <laughs> Miss Lauren in today? Or, uh, what the fuck did you just say? <laughs> what did you just say? Sorry, my brain, I'm not <laughs> I said Miss Raylan! <laughs> Miss Raylan! <laughs> Into the earth. <laughs> Into the earth. No! Oh. Now don't do that. Now you know there's gonna be more of them growing. <sighs> uh, is, that, is that how One it works? One moment, I got it.
come on. Come on, Cedric. There he is. <laughs> there he is. All right. Now be careful, or I'll send you to the back rooms. What's that? You don't want to go down there. Oh, okay. He's staring menacingly at me. Should I be afraid? I would run. Hurry before he before he moves. <laughs> Come back here, Cedric. Come back here, Cedric. Oh, what's up? Is there something needed? <laughs> Jesus! Jesus! Yeah. What took you so long? <laughs> oh God. <sighs> These the fume for the forges of the fume the fume of the forge. Fuck me, jeez. What the fuck? <clears throat> The fumes of the forge fuck with your mind. That's the one. <laughs> <laughs> That's the one. Don't read my lines. Ah. <laughs> it's like I know you. <laughs> this whole thing is scripted. Next page. That's exactly what it says. Tain, tain, tain. Tain, tain, tain. Kyla, Kyla hits sword. Uh, da, 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 da. Bag of gold drops from the ceiling lands in his hands. I have a different version of the script, I guess. Damn, it must have been. It must have been a revision. Shit. It must have been a revision. <laughs> we could just skip to the sex scene if you wanted. I mean, I'm totally okay with that. Well, so that doesn't sound half bad at this point. And if you, uh, if you need anything built, like, if you need your tool halves fixed or anything like that, be sure to let me know. Aldo, do you want your nails? Or should I just eat them? Are they done? Yeah! Nails are important. Oh, wow, you moved. Don't ever approach me. The dwarf is approaching at Mark 5. Yes, don't say it. <laughs> oh, oh, hello. Wow. Uh, you... That's amazing white hair. Yeah? <laughs> yes, that's actually really cool. Oh, thank you. Really I a lot of nice people. Grew up myself. Yes. You still owe me 40 copper, mm. though. Hello. And I do have that 40 copper. Very good. I also need to put it in order for another set of nails. <laughs> okay. So, uh, actually, you know, if I'm going to do that, here's 80. Okay, right. All right. Thanks, Aldo. Mm -hmm. uh, be sure to let me know when they're Wait, done. Wait, you don't want the nails? I know what I'm doing. Where are they? <laughs> Give them to me. <laughs> There you go. <laughs> Did it look naily? I mean, a nail's a nail, so long as it's not bent. 
Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is the smithy, so if you ever need your tool sharpener or anything, they could probably help you out. Oh, wow. It's really big. Mm -hmm. Just don't look at the roof. I don't know if Marcus has fixed it yet. Working nine till five. <laughs> uh, where's my fucking dad? I think I'm probably just gonna start running people over. Oh. How can you do that? I'm What were you saying? Um, hmm. Oh, nothing. What? What? Are you... What is that? Nothing. I don't know, I found it. What are you... I don't see anything. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Again? <laughs> this one wasn't even scary. Oh. Gone again. Oh, it's gone now. I don't know what it is. It, it just shows up sometimes. I scared God away. Oh no. What do we call it? I, it just shows up sometimes. I was we we're gonna I was gonna buy something the other day and it showed up and said, Yeah, this looks like a good deal, and then left. So I uh Well uh the To be honest, I never imagined God shoulder. would actually look like that. I I was imagined be a bit bigger. Well, you know. Like, it's not about the size, it's about how you use it. Where is... Farmer, fucker, where did the fuck... Uh, fuck? This fucking anvil is magnetic. Why were you pink? Don't worry about it. Well, are you sure you'll be okay, uh, Ron? I'll be okay. Are you gonna go for a wander or something? I bet. Although I don't really want to leave you alone with that around. I'll be okay. If it wanted to kill me, I feel like it would have already by now. I think it's just trying to fuck with us. I wish I had my fucking blades so I could skew that thing if it touches you. <laughs> Your blade's iron, right? Steel, actually. Oh, fuck. Yeah, that's gonna be a while. No, though, I don't know how. At least that's why originally it said it was, although... If depends it's... on what the theme says, I suppose. I would assume it's steel. It just means it's gonna take us a lot longer because we need to make steel y using iron and cold coke and then that makes it a lot more expensive so yeah we'll get to it soon though once we get enough money together so if you can find a way to get his money that would speed the process up quite a bit all right i'll be okay Okay. I'll see you around then. I hope so. Hmm. Ah, don't get too crazy be out. Don't get too crazy with me but not being around, alright? Of course. I'll be a good good drow boy. <laughs> Very good. My little drow champ. <laughs> Stop. Fuck, what was that meme? That day made? I'm not 
it's an FT spoilers or FT. It's an FT. There are some great memes being done right now. <laughs> there it is. Oh, jeez, that's a me. <laughs> All good? Yeah. It's a really, it's a really good roll. <laughs> Here's my sneaky little drow. Oh, jeez, that's a me. <laughs> I knew the one when you said meme, yeah. <laughs> now there are some bangers there. I need a sippy sip. I don't feel too hot right now, I'll be honest. I feel quite... <sighs> bleh, you know? Ow, stepped on my cord. Um... Uh, Mr. Apprentice uh, Smith, were you... If, if you remember me from last time, uh, you wouldn't happen to know if it's... If it's tax season right now, would it? I hope not. I don't think it is. I, I see. <clears throat> remember, if, if, if you change your mind, uh -huh. uh, if you do need extra help in keeping your books or your... your uh, I believe you said your overhead. Um, I'll be around. Okay, sure. I'll find you. Appreciate your attention. Appreciate it. Good morning. Morning. How are you? I'm okay. Just puttering through work today, now that we're not <laughs> under the hammer anymore. Haha. -ha. Not under the hammer, you <laughs> sure? Yeah, yeah. yeah, no, now that... still hovering around. Yeah. No, now that that order's not done, or that order is done, I can just kind of roll through all the other backlogs, which are quite a bit. Oh, okay. What you got working on? There's a sword. There's a sword. Okay. sword. Oh, I just did this sword, actually. All I, don't, right, there's a sword. I don't need that anymore. So I just, oh, you it, just, it's you three just swords, yeah. All right. I went nice. from working on six swords to yeah. working on three swords. Oh my gosh. Yeah. All right, making progress. Yeah. <laughs> Would you like to make something that's not a sword? What are you thinking? Just to change it up a bit. I need, because I'm keeping a 10 foot distance from well, I know it's bad for me. Um, Gravity's God. bad for you. I'm making a ladder. Uh huh. <laughs> right. Yeah, the, falling on the anvil will do that to you. It's yes. Uh huh. At least I didn't go into the forge. Yeah, that could have been Jeez. funny. I mean, terrible. No, that would have been really bad. <laughs> I would, I'd probably be dead. Um, hinges. Hinges, okay. So it'd be like small, I think that's small iron. That's a medium, medium iron. Okay. Fuck. Uh, it's one of those. Yeah. Shoot. Okay. Medium iron uh -huh. to make... I have two ladders. Uh-huh. I want to combine them into a foldable ladder. A foldable ladder? This will be really useful because it's not just one, but two ladders. You know, you can go higher. You're a genius. Why haven't more people it's thought about that? It's just taking two ladders and just... Oh. Anyway, it's not just to fix that. Anytime we need to go two fucking stories anywhere, uh, yeah. I have a giant ladder. Hey, that's handy. Yeah, I can uh, work on some hinges. Um... Right, oh, hey there. Good morning. <laughs> lift you farther in the air. Yeah, I don't, no, I don't, yeah, don't want to die. Yes. <laughs> Very good. I can do that. Um, it'll cost <clears throat> one silver twenty. And it can be done tomorrow. -ish. Right. Appreciate it. Absolutely. I'll get on that. Oh, okay. Tomorrow. I'm sitting to... down on your stool. 
Oh, go for it. <laughs> I'll have to do some more work orders then. Whew. All right. Uh, besides the roof, is there anything you need uh, fixed here? Uh, no, I think we're onto it. Okay. Or any additions? You know, no one ever thinks about additions to their uh, home or workplace. Um, I was thinking like, like roller doors. Roller doors made of what? Uh, didn't think that far. <laughs> Wait, you want to close off this entire place? Yeah, I, if someone walks in, I want to be able to... Like, like this young lad who... Or older gentleman, I should say, who comes just walking through. I've got good news for you. You're giving me a look. Let oh, me finish okay. writing this down, and then I can talk to you, because I'm going to forget otherwise. <laughs> Right. Uh, Mr. Vesrin, good, good morning. Good morning. Medium eye. <laughs> I'll just turn my hands around.